latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Caitlin Canoe with 41 Action News. Here's a look at your headlines this January 19th. COVID-19 has now claimed more than 400,000 American lives, with more being lost every day. This grim mark in the country's history met today with a National Day of Remembrance and Mourning. All across the nation, flags are standing to represent those who've lost their battle to this terrible plague. Another concern, the vaccine rollout across the nation. Right now, many states are scrambling just to find more doses. In New York City, the mayor said the city will be out of vaccines this week. Several states have begun reaching out directly to Pfizer and other manufacturers to order shipments directly. On Capitol Hill, the U.S. Senate reconvened. Two key topics dominating the opening remarks from leadership from both parties, impeachment and confirming cabinet members for the soon-to-be president's administration. This all comes as the U.S. Capitol is preparing for tomorrow's inauguration of President-elect Joe Biden. This year, large crowds won't be allowed to attend the inauguration for security and pandemic reasons. Following the deadly riot at the Capitol earlier this month, the streets in and around the Capitol, the, nation, the National Mall, as well as the White House are all lined with tall fencing, barbed wire, even concrete barriers. Now here's Gary with a look at the forecast. Caitlin, as we move through this week, our attention is going to be focusing on the AFC Championship game. The NFC Championship game is up in Green Bay. They may have snow up there, but what about us? 24 degrees tomorrow morning to start the day. We'll warm up to about 40 by 10. 54 degrees for the high temperature, 49 degrees by evening, a breezy and cool evening as we look ahead to the weekend, 56 Thursday, 36 Friday, 40 Saturday, there is a chance of rain on Sunday, not sure yet, so I'm not up to 50% chance yet, so hopefully it stays dry for the game. Doesn't look like a major storm at this moment, but maybe some weather impacts for the game.